Hi friends, today I am giving a lecture on example problems on combinations with repetition in permutations and combinations. In the previous video, we are already discussed about four example problems on combinations with repetition. Now in this video, we have to discuss about two example problems. Okay. First one, a bag contains coins of seven different denomination with at least one dozen coins in each denomination. In how many ways can we select a dozen coins from the bag? This is the a given problem. So what is the data given in the problem? So a bag contains seven different denominations. For example, uh, 10 rupees coin, 5 rupees coin, 2 rupees coin, 1 rupee coin, 100 rupees coin. So it is like 7 different denominations can be contained by a bag. Okay. In each and every denomination, how many number of coins are there? 12 coins are there. Okay. Now, in how many ways can we select a dozen coins from the bag? This is the uh, problem. Okay. So now the data is number of denominations is equal to 7. Number of coins to be selected with the repetitions is equal to 12. Okay. So we may select a 12 coins. Okay. In the 12 coins, there may be repetition is also there. Okay. Next. Number of ways to select a dozen coins from the bag. Okay, so combinations with the repetition, the number of ways to select a dozen coins from the bag with the repetition, the formula is C of R plus N minus 1 comma R. Okay, R plus N minus 1 comma R. So where R is equal to number of coins that are to be selected with the repetition. So that is the how many number of coins that we are select? That is a 12. Here n is nothing but number of denominations. So n is equal to 7. Okay. Substitute these values in the above formula. So C of R value is 12. 12 plus n value is 7. 7 minus 1 comma 12. Okay. Now, so C of 12 plus 7, that is 19, 19 minus 1, that is 18. So 18 comma 12. So that is equal to C of 18 comma 12. So that is 18 factorial divided by, so 12 factorial into 18 minus 12, that is a 6 factorial. 18 minus 12, that is 6 factorial. It can be written as 18 into 17 into 16 into 15 into 14 into 13 into 12 factorial divided by so 12 factorial so 12 12 cancel next 6 factorial can be written as 6 into 5 into 4 into so 3 into 2 into 1 okay so now uh, 6 into 3 that is 18 cancel Next one, 2 into 18. Next one, 5 into 3. Next one, uh, 4 into 2. Okay. So now, how many number of ways? 17 into 2. That is uh, 34. 34 into 3. So 34 into 3. So 1 or 2. 1 or 2 into 14. 14 2 is 28, 14 0 2, 14, okay, into 13, so 13, 13 8s, 1 at 4, 26, 36, 52, 55, 13 ones, 13 plus, 18,564 ways, so 18,564 ways are there to select 12 coins 
Okay, 12 coins from a given bag. Okay, next. Next, we go for another problem. In how many ways can we distribute 12 balls among 7 baskets? Okay, so here, how many number of balls are there? That is 12 balls are there. Number of baskets is equal to 7. Okay, so now number of ways to distribute 12 balls among the 7 baskets. Okay, the formula is, okay, repetition is allowed. So combinations with the repetition allows. Okay, 12 balls may be distributed into 7 baskets with the repetition allowed. So the formula is C of N plus R minus 1 comma R. Okay. Here, so what is uh, uh, N value? Here, N value is equal to 7 number of baskets and R value is equal to how many number of balls that we are distributed. That is a 12. So therefore, so C of 7 plus 12 minus 1 comma 12. So that is equal to C of 7 plus 12. So that is a 19. 19 minus 1 that is a 18. So 18 comma 12. So that is equal to 18,564 ways are there. Okay. So both problems contain the same answer. Okay. So in this way we have to solve the given problem. So how many number of ways? 18,564 ways are there to distribute 12 balls among the 7 baskets with the repetition allowed. Okay. So thank you. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please share this video to your friends and classmates. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel name. So, Divella Srinivas Rao.